Hi everyone. Okay, this is my first planner video. I want to try this out. Um, let me tell you, this is going to be a video about me starting the planner. Um, this is the second time I ran through it because the first time it was too dark and I couldn't change the settings, the light settings on it. So let's see if I can remember what I just said. Um, this is actually going to be a video on my thought process of beginning the planning. Um, I joined a few Facebook groups. I don't, I don't know what got me involved in the whole planner thing. I don't know what sparked it, but something did. And I uh, so I joined Facebook groups and stuff, and I have been obsessed with it. And I've been obsessed with the whole planner, planner thing, the planner community. I didn't know it was a community until I started joining them, and I'm like, oh my god. So let me tell you my thought process on this. I um, I want the Erin Condren uh, planner. Um, that's the one I want and then I want the CD um, which is you if you watch my videos you know what that is but it's the the new simple stories planner and I watched a video where you can take the, the Aaron Condren uncoil it and put it in the CD um, planner so that's what that is what I'm going to do I'm hoping I can get my daughter involved and she'll she'll want I'm hoping to give this to her but I don't know she's not very she doesn't like this stuff she's been fishing so that's her thing anyways um, so, but I went to, from what I understand, Erin Condren um, planners, you can find at some staples. Of course, not any of our local surrounding staples. So I decided I really wanted to give, uh, try my hand at this. So um, I went to Michael's today and I had a 50% off coupon. So I got the, uh, me and my big ideas, the Create 365, the Happy Planner for $19 out the door. That's with our taxes because our taxes are like nine and a quarter. Um, so if you have a half off coupon and you have um, less sales tax than we do, then it'd be way cheaper. Um, anyways, uh, I, this is, I wanted to start out, I wanted to start out with something, right? And so I ended up getting this one. Um, I love it though. It's pretty. Isn't it pretty? I loved it. Um, so I decided, let me open it. This is, uh, I decided to um, go with a theme because I, I, I love themes and themes work for me. All this stuff came from paper issues except for the um, the shark and that came from Avery L. That's their stamp set, um, Unfreckled Fawn. But then this, I used the diamond press for this and then I used the diamond press for the um, cork, right? So that was cool. So I got to use the diamond press and I was pretty happy about that. Um, and then let's see, is this, let's see. Okay, so, um, what I thought was, let me go with the theme. Let me figure out what I have because as a project lifer, we have stickers, we have washi, we have paper, we have all that stuff. So use what you have and instead of buying extra, just use what you have because that works, right? And so this is like most of it's from Cartabella and I bought it um, with the thought of project life and for the bullies and going to the beach and that kind of stuff this summer So it worked out. I have all this stuff already. So I didn't buy anything extra for the planner um, the Erin Condren um, Because of all the Etsy shops and stuff they they cater a lot to Erin Condren and but from what I understand what I'm reading on some of them is that um, a lot of the stickers that they make for the Erin Condren's will fit in this uh, the happy planner so I haven't bought any yet but I'm I'm almost thinking I'm not going to so I might end up you know sticking with this one I'm not sure but after I'm done I, I wanted after let me think about what I want to say first um let me think because this stuff was in my stash these little stickers were in my stash now there are some things that I would not use in my project life because I like themes and for my pictures talk to me on what my theme will be right and this one this one to me felt a little more more hodgepodgey and more like just fun right a little bit more fun there's no pictures involved it's just you know playing around and having fun this way well um so I decided to go this route and I think I'm gonna keep I think after doing this it doesn't start till July though. That's my only thing. I was on my like, bummer. It doesn't start till July. Um, they have where they have after the the month. They have um, they have it where you have the weekly. I'm not sure. Uh, see, I don't have I don't have 
a big life. I don't have a big social life. I don't have anything. So when I have one thing in my calendar, I'm like freaking out because I'm like, I don't want to, right? And so I think, I don't think I'm going to do the weekly. I think I like the month because to me, it's fun. It's, you see it all in one glance. So what I ended up doing was I took my paper clips. I'm not sure if you can see those. I took the paper clips and I clipped the months together. And so now when I open it, it will be August. This is August. See, and what I did is I, I, um, I decorated um, July. This is July. And so I added some, I added a couple pictures because, you know, these are the pictures that I printed out that didn't um, make it into my album. There's so many of these guys and, you know, I take pictures every single day of these guys. So I have plenty of extra. So, and, and even if I didn't, the Project Life just print out pictures and I put them in here on the front. And then during that month, I will probably fill this out because why not? That sounds like fun, right? It says July currently, and uh, this is Tim's birthday month, so I'll make sure I decorate um, this month, and I can cover this. And I just added a couple of extra things. These were in the Cartabella, um, in, what is it, what's it called? Um, the, um, one of the packs. It's not, it wasn't the embellishment, uh maybe pieces, I don't know, but they wouldn't fit in the Project Life um, area. So I put them here because that way it goes with the theme and I thought it worked out and uh, I, I'm, I'm digging it. So for this one is July and I think I'm going to go with this because it's, um, it, it makes me smile. It makes me, it makes me want to write down stuff, you know, even if it's just like, you know, um, the chickens, you know, laid their first egg, I'll put in here. And then that way, when I do my project life, I can put it, I'll, I can go back and I can look when, when they did, you know, that kind of thing. So I can write things as I go during the day. And then, you know, a shopping list, I can have a shopping list here. I can uh, write, you know, what, what I made for dinner, you know, that kind of thing, just for fun. Because like I said, I don't, I don't have a job. I don't, I don't have, I don't do anything. I don't have to go get Cordell. I don't, you know, there's things that I don't have to do. So most so this will just be decoration and, and fun. But I figure, you know what, if I had something to do on the 13th and this is here, all I'll do is get a sticker, um, like one of those plain stickers and write what I need to do and stick it on top or put um, one of those page flaps on top or a post-it note on top. So there's just, so um, I'm not worried about me having to actually do something on this day and it's covered so you can't really see it because there, if there's a will there's a way right <laughs> so uh, but this is my first first ever um planner um that's mama coming down the hallway um this is uh, my first ever planner um page and i'm excited i really want to do this uh erin Condren, i guess you can order on june 1st so I'm excited about that and I ordered my CD planner from uh, Cassie from Paper Issues which like I said all this stuff came from her so I like collections and um, I think I'm gonna do that like you know June July is uh, summer you know August is you know like start of something else you know who knows right I, I can't think of it's Cordell's birthday month but I don't know what theme I would necessarily use with it but like October you have pumpkins so you know you do the um so in October I'll probably do the fall stuff you know and the stuff that won't make it into my project life I can put on here and I really I it is what you want it to be so I am going to do um I'm going to do monthly for now and then if I if I end up wanting to do more I can do the um the weekly but let me show you real quick what it looks like so this is the month at a glance this is the weekly and there's you know I guess morning noon and night and that just and then it looks like I think to me for right now in my head right now this would be a waste of product <laughs> this would be a waste because you know I don't I don't have and you know I don't I don't I guess because I'm using my stuff for project life and for here it would be too much and a lot of the stuff too I like um, sharing with other people you know I like cutting up things and giving it as a giveaway or you know just something like that too so this way I can spread it out three ways which is my project life planner and giveaway um, so right now I'm gonna do a month at a glance so you know what pick don't overwhelm yourself really and that's what I, I the biggest thing I want to tell you guys is don't overwhelm yourself with thinking you have to fill up the weekly start with the month 
like I did and you know get a feel for it and then go from there so you know because I might end up doing every block uh, with papers after this one you know for August or yeah August I might end up doing that I don't know but and in the meantime you don't have to spend a lot of money um, it's not needed it really isn't because you already have this stuff if you if you do project light or even regular scrapbooking you have all this stuff and even if you don't you can go to the dollar store and get some stuff you don't have to go you know hog wild you can just have a little bit of fun um, the puppies are still here sleeping so sorry guys that's some snoring um just in case you're new to my channel since i'm gonna label this as a as a planner video um so yeah so create 365 happy planner and i'm happy i pretty i i am i i like this i like the way it looks and um it, it's making me want to um open it you know it, it makes me want to look in there and i love all the paper clips and stuff and you can get all these from paper issues and remember to use the code facebook because you can get all this and just use the code facebook and get 20 percent off all your orders and um, she has all of these so win-win right <laughs> so thank you guys for watching and i hope i helped maybe a little bit um i say give it a shot guys really just give it a shot this is from the project life um let me show you this was the um paper issues i got it it's the, the cartabella right but this is the three by four well i got the four by six but the four by six had um all these it had one four by six it had all the little sayings well, I took the ones that I know that I won't put in my Project Life, and I cut them smaller, and I cut off the sides and put them here. See, so it, you already have it in your stash if you bought the, and these were, what, 89 cents, I believe. So that's, you know, that's really good, and it was fun, and this was also, this is in the embellishment pack, I think, too. So, yeah, I say, you know what, and then I ended up using the stickers I already had, um, the number stickers from like the Webster's, um, which you can also get from them, which are like $1.99 or less than that. And I I wanted to put the dates. So I didn't like them being covered and me not seeing it, even though it's like the 12, 13, 14, even, you know, we can all figure that out. But I still like the adding the dates on there. So I thought that was fun. And you know what, you, you have these stickers that you get you know especially like um the alphabet stickers and they have the numbers on them you're not going to use them you really don't use them too much in your project life so you'll never run out so might as well put them here and then you can see them right so i thought it was fun and i i'm i'm happy you guys and this <laughs> i thought this was a flaw underneath the um shark before i put it there but it's not it's actually um i think it's a i think it's the or no maybe Hmm, I don't know. I thought it was, uh, yeah, see, it's, um, no, you know what? I think, yeah. Oh, yeah, see, it's a little decoration from them, so it's not like, um, so don't think it was an, a cover-up, but you can cover up whatever you, if you think you make a mistake, just go ahead and cover it. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, I hope you guys like it. It's, it was super fun, so we'll, um, talk to you guys later and you know what I'll show you my monthlies um when I do them so every month I'll show you because I, I want to go month by month I don't want to do it ahead of time maybe I don't know yeah because I don't see myself doing all 12 months like right now because that wouldn't be fun right because then you'd be done so <laughs> but I'll share what um what I'm doing um when I do them so have a good night um have a great weekend and I will see you guys all soon bye babes